Hi friends, welcome to Early Learning. My name is Alex and today I'm going to read a story about building. This story is called Building a House. This story is written and illustrated by Byron Barton. On a green hill, wow friends, so we're noticing there are some trucks coming and this hill is fairly empty. Let's see what's going to happen. A machine digs a big hole. So here we have a bulldozer digging a huge, huge, huge hole. What do you think they're going to build? Builders hammer and saw. So here we are. These builders are laying the foundation of the structure that they're going to build. That's very important. If the foundation is not very strong, the structure is going to collapse. So this is a very important part of the building process. A cement mixer pour cement. And here it is. The mixer is pouring all the cement. And then the workers are using a shovel to flatten it. And then they're, they want to smooth it out so it's nice and straight. Bricklayers lay large white blocks. The bricklayers are actually pouring cement in between each one of the bricks. And that makes it kind of stick like glue and stay together. carpenters come to make a wooden floor. A floor is very important because if you notice, it's shallow where the foundation was built. You don't want to fall under there, so you need a floor. And then they put up walls. Here they are, they're bringing something that looks something like wood, and they're building the walls. They build a roof. And friends, now they're building, now that they built the walls, they're building a roof. A bricklayer builds a fireplace and a chimney too. So now that they're finished with the roof, they're also adding a fireplace and a chimney. A plumber puts pipes for water. So this is very important for a house, friends, because you want to make sure you have water in the house. So when you're using the bathtub, the faucet, the sink, or even the shower, you want to make sure that you have water in your home. So the plumbers have a very important job in making sure that all the pipes are well put together so the water can flow and you can have running water in your home. An electrician wires for electric lights. Friends, it's also very important for you to have light in your home. And this can be a tricky task because electricians deal with a lot of wiring all around the house. You wanna make sure you have light in every room in your home. So this is the electrician fixing the wires to make sure the house has light. Carpenters put windows and doors. So remember the carpenters were in charge of putting the floor and now they're also putting the windows and the doors. So here we have one strong carpenter put in a big door and then another strong carpenter put in the window. Very important. We want to make sure we have windows so no wind or water come into our house and doors are important too. Painters paint inside and out. So here we have a painter painting the house red on the outside. And then we have another carpenter. She is painting on the inside. She's painting the, the inside of the house white. Workers leave. And friends, this is a finished product. After all their hard work, the workers got to go and look at the finished product of the home. It looks really wonderful. A house is built. And there they go. Oh, let's see friends. This truck is coming and a small car is coming. And if you notice, it says moving. 
there's someone moving. The family moves in. So here is a family who either purchase or is renting the home and they are happy to be living there. They're bringing all their things in there and they're ready to use the house friends. Friends, I hope you enjoy the story and that you get inspired because all of you are really, really good builders. Whether you're building with Legos, blocks, or any other materials, you are really good at building, friends. So get inspired and build something today, friends. Till next time, bye friends.